Killapur Games, your Kofa David Mac guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone's having an amazing day. As always, guys, today we are here at my favorite vaquero store, should I say cowboy store, here at Boot Barn, guys. And today, I figured I'd take you guys on a little shopping spree with me because a lot of people are curious. I'll be getting DMs and messages. David, where do you get your boots at, your pants? And this is where I get it, guys. So basically, I'm not on a budget today. I know I've done like a lot of budget videos, like at Walmart and at Marshalls, on how to save money and get a vaquero outfit. Today, I'm just gonna buy anything I want, anything I like, basically. You guys ready? Let's go. We're gonna start with the boots first. Uh, low key right now, like I, I don't know if you guys been seeing in my videos, but like my boots are like legit trash. If you pay attention to my pictures, like my boots are like faded and like. Oh! Somebody! Oh! He no. needs some milk. Ripped. So I definitely need a new pair. I'm probably gonna get some like ostrich. I guess I had a, a pair of ostriches like two years ago, and I ripped them up. So. Uh, I'm probably gonna get like some ostrich or these are pretty nice. Uh, how much are these? These are like uh, $4.99. Yeah, I'm not gonna get these. Ooh, that pop. That pop. Guys, look at my boots. Look how dirty these are. Like, that's like ugly as shit. That's embarrassing. So, look at the difference, bro. Oh, yeah, they're cute. Damn. Uh, ice skaters? What? <laughs> Alright bro, so what do you think about these right here? Dude, I was gonna get those, so I'm- <laughs> You know what's funny is I told her, I was like, dude, watch, I'm gonna get these boots. And, and, and gonna, gonna, gonna- She's gonna say that she I was, was gonna, gonna get them. <laughs> it's cause, dude, I work here. Guys, so I bought some boots like a long time ago, some Shut black up, ones. But and I never she got them. Like, she was like, I was gonna get those. <laughs> Dude, but the thing is, look at my boots, dude. I I still like don't have life. Bro, what is that? Dog? I know, and I work here. That's embarrassing. Same, 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 same. Bro, no, those are worse. Yeah, they are. Let me worse. see. Look at this. Look at this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I know, but those are clean though. Yeah, I'm gonna get those. Those are very good brand, Hold very it. comfortable. So like, with someone like, if I get down, you're like, oh, those mine's getting down. <laughs> she knows everything. She works here. These are better because they last Oh longer. my gosh, she wants me to get the rubber bottoms, guys. Look at this. Why not? These don't have the rubber bottoms. They're a little different. These are like, I mean, these are good for dancing, but yeah. I mean, if these last longer. Well, these are ice skaters. Huh? Ice skaters. Oh, okay. These, what do you think about these? But they last Yeah, try Yeah, they don't, they don't last longer. These last sure. longer? And we go to Coyotes and here, get your boot, bro. Okay. <laughs> hey, I'm telling you, when you, you come home drunk as hell. Oh, yeah. I have like, one of those in my like, room. This man. is there. He's like, yeah, guys, get her free. You just <laughs> get one of those. Go and knock out like that. Let me try these. The rubber bottoms? They're comfortable yeah. too. Ooh, that looky fit me a little like tighter, like kind of like a snug fit. Yeah, they're comfortable. Yeah, like these. What the other one? What do you think? Oh, but with these, I can't ice skate though. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna pick one. I don't yeah, even go to clubs. I don't even go to clubs. She's making fun of my shoe size, guys. Or should I say boot size, guys? So. Uh, this, is, this is the ones I'm gonna end up getting. I'm not gonna show you guys exactly the price yet till we get home. I'm gonna get uh, some pants still. I'm gonna get uh, I'm gonna get a button up, and then um, we'll keep going. Guys, like, why do I have to be so skinny? Like, I can't. Like, this happens all the time. Every boot one I go to, if I find my size, it's like the last one on the shelf. So, look, it, like they're all like 36, 36, 38, 34s, 32s. But, um, yeah, I don't know. Alright guys, so I found the closest size that I can find is 30 by 34s. So it's one size uh, bigger on the waist, 30 by 34s. This is my last option if you don't have uh, my size, so it's all good though. Push me left, push me left. Yeah. So what you think about that right now? You can help you out right over here. Pretty nice, nice. Pretty nice. Okay, okay. Put a Wrangler, a Wrangler. A little Wrangler. I like that. The only jeans, 
Tá um nudinho, Zé Fê. Ah, não, Palinho aqui, né? Oh, hell no. Deixa eu sair. Alright, guys, we officially left the barn. So, we're gonna go home, guys. And um, I'm gonna put everything on and I'm gonna show you guys exactly how much I spent and what I got. I'm pretty sure you guys seen what I got already, but just, you know, I wanna get more into detail and, you know, on the price and all that. So, see you guys at home. Don't forget to get my truck. Don't forget to get the truck. Uh, Sexy. Follow me at With the level. new sticker. She's a little dirty right now. She's a little dirty. Right now, dirty as fuck. Let's go. All right, guys, so we just got back home from Boo Barn and I just finished putting out the outfit that I got. So, starting at the top, because I know a lot of you guys are wondering, David, where the hell did this come from? I actually got this about two years ago at Boo Barn. Uh, it's a felt, it's a Cody James. And um, yeah, guys, I got it there for like 60 bucks. I'm pretty sure they have my all Boo Barns. But uh, I just bought it there and then I got it shaped somewhere else. So, if you guys have someone that shapes hats, um, just, you know, buy it at Boo Barn and just take it to the person who shapes because that's way cheaper than buying like a freaking. Two hundred dollar uh, Tejana or um, uh, felt. So, coupon guys, sixty bucks. And then I just added, you know, the sick ass put away on the patch. We'll be down to the outfit that I actually bought. I bought everything else. Um, starting at the top, guys. I got you know a basic Wrangler shirt. I would wear a put away on the shirt because I like to wear a lot of put away on the shirts and hats. So, I got this Wrangler shirt. It's comfortable as well. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna hate on Wrangler because I, I have a lot of Wrangler stuff. I like the shirt, really nice. Uh, it's, like, it's, it's like a gray with the yellow, like the yellow borderline, I mean the border with the white Wrangler uh, logo. So, just a, a regular, you know, Wrangler t-shirt. You can kind of rock this with anything. Uh, this shirt, guys, actually cost me exactly $22. So, not bad, not bad. Look clean? Yeah, looks good. All right, guys, moving down to the bottom, uh, to the jeans, Eagle. I ended up getting the Wrangler Retros. I think I said that name like a million times because I have like five pairs of these jeans, guys. I'm not even kidding. I tried the Cody James. I tried the um, the Ariads, the Sense jeans. And for some reason, these jeans are the only ones that fit me good because I'm really skinny. Like these jeans actually make me like look like I'm kind of like like thick. You know what I'm saying? So. Uh, they are called the Wrangler Retros uh, Slim Boot. Make sure you guys get them uh, boot cut at the bottom. There are some people that could like could uh, get like slim straights and it looks good on them. For some reason, I can't get the slim straights, so I get slim boot. I get them a little longer at the bottom. I get them 30 by 34s. That way they go uh, over my boots. Super good. It's like it has like that that kind of like that white fade with like that dark blue on the outside. I think it looks pretty cool with the white stitching. Really nice jeans. Super comfortable. Like I said, guys, I have like five pairs. They're super comfortable. I would recommend them. These jeans ended up costing me exactly $59.99 with taxes. I'm pretty sure they were like 60 bucks. So $60 jeans, guys, and uh, a $22 shirt so far. Keep that in mind. Now, moving down to the bottom, last but not least, right, guys, are the boots. I did end up getting the ones that you guys seen in the in the video, I tried them on a couple times. Uh, they're just um, some ostrich guys, some ostrich boots. It's like the, what that dark, that dark brown. My first time, guys, getting rubber bottom boots. I've never had rubber bottom boots, guys. Uh, I heard they're super comfortable, and I'm not gonna lie, they really are. Like they're probably more comfortable than the Cody James, but uh, you know, the rubber. So they're supposed to last you a little longer. He has like that white stitching right there and it's the ostrich they're gonna get dirty so i'm pretty sure these the white's gonna fade after a while but um yeah it has that that wood see shit totally trippy as that wood the ostrich this this is how they look on on top so they're not that um high up my freaking coated james are like up here so these are like they're really loose too it's like leather so they're really nice guys super comfortable i'll give you guys an update in like about like I don't know a couple months but so far I like them there's not much to say about the boots the thing I can say is that they're super expensive guys these boots were actually four hundred and thirty two dollars guys broke my wallet because I'm not rich at all I'm not like I'm not gonna lie for boots they're super expensive you don't have to get these boots I just I like them and I wanted to get them oh so, give them a little quick spin this is the uh, full outfit guys um, I think the total dollars I think like five but, um, super nice outfit guys uh, Super basic and clean Like I said I did want to get a button up to make it seem like To kind of finish it off with that super, like, 
get out, fill it with the button up, but like I said guys, I couldn't find my size and I didn't really, I don't really like button ups here. If I would get a button up, it would have to be like an H&M or like at Marshall and stuff like that because I actually like their button ups and I'm not even saying that because I'm like staying on a budget. I really like button ups at H&M and at Marshall's. So uh, it's all good though. I would have rocked this shirt super clean. I'll probably rock it a few times. And uh, that being said guys, yeah, that's the outfit. Make sure you guys drop a like guys, subscribe. Comment down below, let me know what you guys think because I'm super curious. Make sure you guys subscribe if you guys are new to the channel, guys. My name is David Mack, better known as Puro Bailando on Instagram. Make sure you guys turn on your bell notifications. That way you guys get notified each time I post a video. And I will see you guys on my next video. Peace out.